What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'll be showing you guys how to get a fully customizable lobby bot with a custom name and a custom status. And this is all gonna be 100% through Discord without any external websites. And it's also gonna work on any device that can run Discord, like your phone, your computer, or any Mac device, or basically anything with a browser because you can access Discord through a browser as well. So before I show you guys that, I just wanna thank you guys again for 35,000 subscribers. And if you saw the most recent video right before this one, uh, we are actually doing a giveaway for our 35,000 subscribers it's a 1,000 people giveaway and you can also enter that within our discord as well and make sure you subscribe to our channel and it really helps us out and let's try to hit 40k subscribers um hopefully by the end of the fortnite season that'd be really amazing if we could do that and also make sure you guys like the video let's try to hit a like goal of 250 likes again so the first thing that you guys want to do is head on into our discord server link is in the description and you're going to go on into here in the discord server So the next thing you want to do is go on into this channel. So you're going to click on create Neo once you are in the Discord server. And then after you do that, um, you're going to see this and it'll say type start to get started. And this is a bot created by a few developers in our server. So now you're just going to want to type in start right over here like that. And you're just going to press enter and it'll delete it. And again, if you guys have any questions, you can always go over here go to ask questions and then you can open up a ticket by clicking on this button and if you also want to know more about the spot you can just go over here i'll be posting the video tutorial here after i make this video so you can always refer back to it and of course we're going to have um the developers posting in here as well about the bot and you can also join their discord server i'll put that in the description so now you're just going to check for a dm that is up here so once you click on that it will show something like this saying get a code and this is just creating a brand new bot so if you've not already click on this link and create a new epic account i already have a new epic account and make sure it is logged in on your main browser that you're using so this mine's called xl neobot so that'll work pretty fine for me so once you've done that you're just going to click on this code this will get an authorization code that'll basically let the bot log into the account and mod it so you're just going to copy that and then once you've done that you're going to go back over here and you're gonna paste it and again make sure you only are copying this part of the code otherwise it will not work so right after the code equals so yeah once you've done that you're just gonna paste that in type enter and just wait a second and there we go we've created the entire bot so that's it just two steps and you're done with it so once you've done that it'll show you all of the current commands the bot is still in development so don't expect too many commands to be in here yet but it's still in development so your bot will probably be updated eventually with the new commands. So the first thing you want to do is, of course, add it as a friend if you've not already. You can always just copy it, or if you're on console, this will also work like this. I'm just going to paste this in, and you're going to click on Add Friend. So once you've done that, it'll friend it, and then it should automatically accept the friend request like this. So then what you're going to do is you're just going to scroll down, and you're just going to click on this and you're going to invite it and you can see that it has this cool um icon so once you've done that you're just going to invite it to your party and the bot will join your party and you can make a party leader if you want it doesn't really matter that much and yeah so now it's inside your party just make sure it's private if you want nobody else to join and then once you've done that you can go back over here so now you can type in any of these commands that you want so of course skin is the normal command so like with every other bot you can just do skin and change the skin to whichever skin you want so we'll just do um we can do skull trooper so just like that and it'll change it to skull trooper and you'll know that it's um gone through correctly if this thing pops up and says that it's changed to skull trooper then you've done it correctly and then you can also change the emote so let's just go check out we have the skull trooper right here and we also change the emote so we'll do emote and then we can change the emote to the floss. And then once that is done, it says windmill floss right there. So if you want the correct floss, um, all you have to do is go over here and change it to just normal floss. But if you really want it to be exact and you don't know the exact command for it, I'll be showing you guys a website that'll let you do that as well. So here's the website, it's fortniteskins.net, and I'll be putting this link in the description for you guys to use. So once you're on here, you can just use the search bar up here and you can find the exact skin that you want. So once you've done that, you're just gonna click on here and you'll have the flossy mode up here. And when you go down over here, it'll have the ID as well. So that's if you wanna get um, specific skins, you can do that. And this ID did not work for some reason. I think they'll be adding support for this in the near future. 
So for right now, it's just doing windmill floss right over here, as you guys can see. And they'll also be adding a ton of other things that we see in other bots to this. So if you want to help them out, just try to create bots to help them like test. Okay, so the next thing is you can have the bot ready up and unready up. So right now you guys can see it's unready. So if you want to just make it look like it's ready in the lobby, it will not actually send you into a game. But if you want to see it's ready in the lobby, um, you can just do that and it's ready. And then if you want to be unready again, just do unready and you're done. And again, this will not send you into any matches, so don't really try to ready up at the same time. It won't do anything. And then if you want to change the Skull Trooper to Purple Skull, you just have to do this. So it's much more simple than the other lobby bots. You can just do Purple Skull. And that'll make it Purple Skull. And then you can also change the backpack. So if you don't want this exact same backpack, we can just change it to the Ghost Portal or something to match this skin. So just go Ghost Portal. And there you go, we got the ghost portal. So it's matching the skin. So the next thing is we can just try out all these commands. So we got the pink cooler over here to change to the pink cool trooper. So we can just type that in right over here. And then once you've done that, it'll be pink cool trooper. And you can also do the renegade. So this is the checkered renegade. So if you just go with renegade 2 it'll change it to the checkered renegade for some reason it did not change it but they have to fix that bug so the next thing that you can do is the hologram um if you guys don't know what the hologram skin um i'm pretty sure it was an npc in an earlier season and yeah that's what it looks like right there so yeah you'll be like hologram looks pretty cool and you can like see right through them so you can see the back bling. So if you want to like show people the back blings, you can switch to the hologram skin. And if you change the pickaxe, you can just um, do this one emote that shows the pickaxe. That's the only way to actually have it show up. So yeah, that is basically it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe and we'll see you guys in another one. And just to clarify, because a bunch of you guys were asking me this earlier, um, the giveaway is through Discord, it's not through YouTube, I will not be going through the comments or anything to select the winner, it will have to be through Discord, so you just go into our Discord server, click on the giveaways channel, and you just click on the red button to enter the giveaway, just to clarify that.